from these young fighters. Floyd, being at the uh, the Rio Games uh, for the Olympics, did you get any flashbacks back in your time in '96? No, because when I went to Rio, when, well, when I went in '96, it was a little different. It was work. I couldn't focus on nothing but work. I wasn't worried worried about going to watch basketball, gymnastics, track and field. I was worried about what I went there for, to compete at the highest level in amateur boxing and be victorious. I came up short, but everything happens for a reason. I was very, very pleased with me receiving the bronze medal because my life wouldn't be where it's at today. I wouldn't be able to give back to young fighters like this. This year I went to Rio just, just as a spectator. Great experience, uh, moving around the city, meeting different people, shaking hands, going to watch track and field, going to watch gymnastics. It was an experience of a lifetime, and I really enjoyed myself. Were well, there any what other fighters? What do you say about Floyd being here in your fight at 4 in the afternoon, where I've never seen really a big-time promoter this early in the arena? Um, <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Well, actually, what I did, I wasn't going to let him down. You know, I'm not able to make it to all my fighters' fights. Sometimes I have, you know, different places I have to be. I have different businesses and different things I have to take care of. But this is a young superstar on the rise, and if I could be there for all my fighters, you know, um, just the other day I'm, I went to the boxing gym. So it's so much young talent on the rise, so much young talent on the rise, and you know it's his special night. I've done my talking. It's time for y'all to talk to him. Uh, very marketable kid, very humble, very gracious. Um, Danny Gonzalez. <laughs> Danny, I'm gonna see what I have for it, you know, kind of in your corner giving you advice tonight, man. Oh, it was great. It was, a, it was a blessing to have him in my way, you know. Um, when I was a kid, I dreamed of just meeting him, you know. I was a kid, I, wanted, I would always look at me with him. My dad used to always tell me, watch him, watch him, he's good, he's good, right? So I'd, oh, every night, every night before my fights, I used to always watch him. And then uh, the day I met him, I was I was going crazy. I was like, I'm not gonna lie, and I, I say this face. I was shaking when I shook his hand, and I didn't even notice, but I was shaking. And then uh, later, when we started talking business, I was like, dang, you know, it's a blessing. To so just, you know, when I was a kid trying to meet him and now fighting for him, it's, it's a very good blessing, you know. I see.